Good morning, and welcome to Morning Manna. Today is Monday, March the 23rd, 2020, and this is episode 3,249. My name is Bruce Turner. Welcome to today's Morning Manna, and a brand new week. Today's episode is titled, Contagious. Stay tuned. Contagious. Well, we all have a better understanding of what that word means now, don't we, due to the COVID-19 virus. I've actually decided that I'm just going to stay home for this week. I won't be doing any Uber or Lyft driving, just uh, spending some time with my wife and... uh, Just uh, evaluating things and especially uh, ministering. We're very, very busy uh, with the ministry at Church Online with Life Church and so many thousands of people uh, using that new platform. I've gotten a number of requests to help churches uh, in our area and even out of our area uh, with uh, transitioning to online uh, services and so forth. And so it's going to be a great, great week, but I'm just going to be uh, staying at home. I'm looking forward uh, this morning to a great meeting with our life group coach team and Pastor Ryan Sharp and the other team members uh, here in about an hour this morning. Uh, we'll have people from the UK, from Spain, the Philippines, and uh, just looking forward to that time of service together. Pastor Craig delivered an awesome message. His message was titled, Hope is Contagious. And I want to share with you some of the thoughts about that because what we're experiencing right now is just incredible, unprecedented uh, in, in our world and, and even in our nation here in the United States where I'm, where I'm based. Um, there are a lot of things that can be contagious besides uh, diseases and um, like fear. Fear is contagious. You know, if you get around somebody and they're just fearful, uh, that's contagious. And by the way, I did have a passenger last week who yawned and said she was sorry that yawns were contagious. (laughs) And You know that yawns are, right? You can just hear a yawn and you'll start yawning (laughs) whether you see it or not. But fear is contagious. Uh, Anxiety is contagious. Anger is contagious. Worry is contagious is contagious. But as believers in the Lord Jesus Christ, we need to be contagious. Now listen to what the Apostle Paul wrote to the church at Thessalonica. He said in 1 Thessalonians 1, 2, and 3, we always thank God for all of you and pray for you constantly. As we pray to our God and Father about you, we think of your faithful work, your loving deeds, and the enduring hope you have because of our Lord Jesus Christ. What needs to be contagious about us? Let me ask you this question. Is what you're carrying worth catching? What should be contagious about us? Well, first of all, our faith. There has never been a time like we have today to show and shine the light of Jesus Christ, to share our faith, to share the gospel. Every single one of us needs to be contagious regarding our faith. What else should we be contagious about? Loving deeds, loving and serving others. And by the way, let me tell you something. If you're struggling with worry, if you're struggling struggling with anxiety and fear, let me tell you, The best remedy for you is to love somebody and serve somebody else. Now, I love where we live, Lynchburg, Virginia, and in the apartment complex that we live in. It's called the Gables at Cornerstone, right off of Greenview Avenue, if any of you are familiar with Lynchburg. They just created a Facebook group page for our our community. And the purpose, the stated purpose, the written purpose in the about section is so that we can share 
needs that people have for delivery, for uh, uh, just anything that, that people need to pick up something, to get something, to, to take something to somebody else. And I, I just think that, that when you love somebody, when you serve somebody else, your mind will just go off of whatever it is you were anxious and worrying about. Remedy for anxiety, remedy for worry is loving and serving others. And then finally, enduring hope. Our hope, our hope in Christ. Jesus is called the blessed hope. And we need to be contagious with those three things. Our faith, our love, and our hope. What happens when we do that? Well, First Thessalonians 1 Thessalonians 1.8 says, And now the word of the Lord is ringing out from you to people everywhere, even beyond Macedonia and Achaia. Forever we go, we find people telling us about your faith in God. Spread the good news. Spread the gospel. Be contagious today. Oh, Father, thank you so much. We have so much worth sharing. Lord, help us today to be contagious with our faith and our love and our hope to others today. Help us, Lord, to be difference makers. And for those who may be struggling with fear and anxiety and worry, Father, help them to be all in on serving others and showing the love of Christ, shining the light, sharing the gospel. In Jesus' name, amen. Our website is morningmana.com. My email address, bruceturner at gmail.com. Have a great day. Till tomorrow morning, this is Bruce reminding you to choose joy. Choose joy.